Today we're going to be going over how to start up Portis Prime. So the first thing you're going to want to do is open up the program. And then you, for a new project you hit New Project Wizard. And then now you're going to want to make a new folder. Make sure the folder is always in the C, in the C drive. If not, it will not run. So we're going to name this folder just the startup folder. And then you hit select folder. And then it's important that you name the project the same exact thing as your folder. If not, it will not compile. And then now you're going to go pick the chip that is necessary. Since I am using the DE2 board, I'm looking for the 11529C7 chip. You don't want to go hit that and then hit finish. Now, depending on what you're going to need, need to make, you're going to want to hit file and then click new. And then, depending on what you need to make, whether it's a, a schematic, VHDL, state machine, or a signal tab, that is the one you'll click. But just for a quick view we're going to hit the block diagram schematic file and once you click that it'll bring you to the page and then you can start working on your project